there mortals, I'm Jensen and welcome back to Dead Space, where no one can famously hear you scream. See, check this out. <laughs> Okay, so, in the previous episode, I'll get on the other side, we just unlocked a brand new area to go into, and I don't think we pushed any further than that, did we? So, we're going to kind of go through the acceptable route that the game developers are kind of leading us to go down in the first place, and we'll see if we can't find something really, really neat directly ahead of us. Uh, let's orient this sideways, because it's OP sideways. Oh, hello, sir. No, that is a suit. Okay, my mistake. What's this? Oh, is this a workstation? Oh, it must be. Scan rig to unlock workstation. We did actually find somebody else's rig in the previous episode. I'm pretty sure his name was Jacob, and I don't know what it does. I don't think that there's anything we can do with it. We can try and hand it in with the store right here. But I'm, I'm not entirely sure there's actually going to be anything to do with it. Never mind! We've unlocked the Ricochet Tracer which is the ammo that gives us the Ripper, which we used in the last episode, which was actually pretty cool, gotta be said. Ah, upgrades. Nice. So we probably actually want to upgrade our plasma cutter. If I'd known this, I probably wouldn't have bought all of those nodes, but we do have ample things to spare. I'm going to sell this golden semiconductor and uh, probably a stack of the plasma energy, because it's everywhere, it's literally everywhere. What is this, oxygen tank? Uh, we are probably not going to be needing that anytime soon, because there's oxygen literally everywhere as well. And now I'm pretty happy with all we've got. We've spent all of our, la our all of our nodes in the last episode too, so we'll come through, and we'll start going downstairs, because I think I remember a stairwell, here we go, on the last episode. Now I don't know if the enemies respawn every time you reload the game. I am so sorry that that guy had to go through what he went through. We'll just follow the path as is required. I'm pretty sure that we have actually been kind of thorough as well in the previous episodes, so I am going to be a little bit less thorough than I usually am in this immediate instance. Yeah, I remember this here. We got one jump scare, and there's a kind of bridge just over this way. Uh, do we have to go down this way? I think we do. Definitely have to do that. Let's get in here, and we will touch that button I didn't even see. We're probably going to get ambushed, and we're probably going to have to cut some limbs off. Which I'm really happy to do. I'm really happy to cut some limbs off of some space zombies. If that's what must be done to survive. It's also fun to do, and I don't necessarily feel bad about clapping aliens. Alien zombies. By the way, I had a come to Jesus moment when I was starting up this game and I realized that the story is literally zombie alien. It's kind of silly, honestly. Oh, that's an actual dude. He's spinning! No! I hate that! Okay, got that guy behind him. Oh, there's so many! Okay, I'm getting the Ripper out. Uh, let's use this against Spinner. That did not do anything. That's not good. Here is the other guy, and... Man, this thing actually kicks a little bit of ass, doesn't it? Excuse me, friends. Oh, no! My head! What? Damn, there are a lot of enemies over there. We're back to where we were, and I now have the explosive cannon out. We're probably going to have to do a little bit of planning, aren't we? Because we could be caught with our pants down. Let's try and pop an explosive preemptively. Damn it, there's bullet drop on it. So let's try and pop one here. Uh, good, we'll reload this gun. Uh, I also want to put some over there, but I know we probably won't be able to reach it realistically. Here they come! There's one right there. Boom! Definitely took him out, and of course that guy has to go too. I think maybe we should keep out this this plasma rifle. It seems to be pretty good. Well, I... In saying that, it's not amazing when it comes to actually dealing damage against the enemies. Oh! Hi! Sorry, friendo, I didn't uh, see you there. We're getting the... Uh, no, not the ripper. That's overkill. Plasma cover. No! Not again! Okay, I saw an explosive tank. We are going to fire at it right now. Boom! Nice! Darling, I'll say goodbye with the big kaboom. With the big kaboom. With the big kaboom. Whoa! Nice. Okay, so now that that's out of the way, what did we get for all of this? We lost half of our health. Actually, we do still have a health pack in our inventory, so we'll use that immediately right this second. 
Use! Done! Now we're almost at full health, which is very cash money. There's a purple thing over here. Oh, an audio log. Great. Progress report filed by Jacob Temple. The engine problems aren't a malfunction. Someone shut off the fuel lines to the primary engine and damaged the valves to hell and back. We just wasted an hour fixing them. Now we need to restart the south refueling station, but some jackass turned off the power and locked up the circuit breaker. No engines? We're gonna hit planet fall soon. What now? There's gotta be someone around here how to spare access card ghost. Did you hear that? Stafford Ghost! I am so distrusting of these vents. I know that there's enemies in them. The game makes it very, very clear that there are always enemies in the vents. They're in the goddamn walls! Quote that one movie, I can't remember. Oh, hello! Sorry, friendo, I didn't, uh, I didn't see you there. Oh, nice shot. They're great! Oh, I didn't even poo my undies. Like, he could have jump scared me. I didn't even poo myself. Uh, we've got a Scott station over here that we will Scott at. Uh, but also, fuel station kick up! That solves all of the problems that we immediately just found. Also some money, something to punch, which gave us some more money as well. That is just an added bonus, I just wanted to punch something. Um, I'm gonna check the map really quickly, because it seems like we're in a little bit of an annoying maze. Ah, it doesn't really seem like we're in an annoying maze. We've basically seen everything that there is to see. We'll Scott really quickly at the Scott station right here. Boop. There we go. Save. And now we'll come out of this with a brand new lease on life. Nicole? Isaac. Hammond. Nicole? Daniels? You made it. Mm. Thank God. After the bridge, we thought that... Glad to disappoint. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I can hear them, but I don't think they know I'm here. Isaac, I tracked down your rig. You're in engineering, right? I am. I'll get myself admin privileges. Maybe I can help. M maybe you can give me admin pri privileges. Clearance confirmed. Oh, can I have what's in it? Or not? That's fine too, I suppose. Is, is this supposed to be a box? Maybe not. Maybe I was literally just supposed to activate that. Okay, so there was actually FA in here. I don't think that there was anything worth having in here, but there is a circuit breaker, which leads to life support and lighting. Hopefully we can disable the... Lighting and not the life support. Uh, let's turn off the lights. That's fine by me. And we'll enable the refuel station because there's one thing I don't like in video games every single time, and that's dealing with uh, time limits. Time limits always bother me. And we've got a torch. Like, what is the harm? Like, literally, what is the harm? There is no harm in doing so. So, this has lit up all the way down here. Who said that? Who said that? Who made the noise of uh, Daddy Longsword from good old Silent Hill? Oh, can I cut this? Oh, I can! What is this? Who knows, honestly. It probably had something to do with the light. Oops, just dropped it. Hi! Excuse me, I, I just need to get past you. I, I don't want any trouble, sir. Excuse me. Just gonna stomp your corpse for some nice money, some nice free money. Excellent. Uh, I think we pretty much got everything that we could get out of this excursion, right? Ah, we definitely lit this up too. Some money here, great. Love it. Pull down? Sure. What the hell? No, that's stasis. Alright, there we go. Refuel the engines! Done! I think I might need my, my mines. My, my boom mines. Yes! Oh, that was well placed! Baby! Alright, let's fire at this baby right here. Because, uh, quite frankly, we don't like the baby. We're not ready for that kind of stuff. I hope Nicole isn't tired. Oh, piss! I reloaded at the wrong time. Let's get the piss and cut her out. What are we doing? Baby? And down it goes. Excellent. So, we have done everything up here. Wonderful. We'll check the map. See if anything new hasn't unlocked. Doesn't appear to be so. Uh, we can do a Scott right now, which would probably be in our best interest. I know it's really, really dark, but I'm pretty sure that I can see. There we go. Who the hell just said that? Sir? Oh, it's a spitter. That's uh, fine, actually. We don't mind. We're just gonna cut him up, up a bit. 
Damn! He was hard to kill. Any more? Maybe. I just wanted to save. That's all I wanted to do. Oh, free stuff. Nice, 400 bucks. Love it. Okay, good. Uh, the intensity is now building up again. We'll save, of course. I think I just heard a necromorph. May not have been a good time to save at all. Let's get one of these spikes that I just stole off of a necromorph's corpse. And if another one pops out, like here. Nope, looks good. I will jam this into its face. No, no one? No one's interested in, in having a little bit of a tussle? We went up there, didn't we? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we went up there. Okay, looks like we are going to be taking this with us. Or not. Put it on here. And then we'll go back over. I think that's all we needed to do. Okay, where's the rest of them? I will fire this at the first enemy that attacks me from a distance. And probably also the plasma cutter. Old reliable. The hell? What was that? Why is everything shaking? I don't know what's going on! Are there enemies waiting for us over here maybe? Oh, we need to reload this thing as well. I don't really see any, any necromorphs. But maybe I'm just being paranoid. I could just be be, be really paranoid. All right, necromorphs, make yourselves known. Or not. Okay, uh, we need to check the map really quickly. So we got to go back this way. And then do a little bit of a roundabout here and go up the stairs. And go left, of course. That sounds like a necromorph. Sounds like a close necromorph as well. Ah, oh, well, you know what they say about close necromorphs? They- Whoa, my god, he's still alive! What? Okay. <laughs> they blow. They blow hard. Close necromorphs, they blow hard. That's what I was going to say about necromorphs. Uh, we could probably actually take that boom canister with us. Probably makes the most sense. Um, I'm pretty sure that this is going to be an objective uh, sequence right here, isn't it? Yep, pull this down, and we have fuel again. Wonderful. Let's grab this boom canister, and we'll hold out here. Excellent. Okay, we've definitely done it. I've got a fuel reading. Hello! <laughs> Could you imagine being that poor bastard? All right, I took his needle. It's probably another one. I hear another one. Oh, pass! Okay, run past here. I hear another one, I think. I'm going to take his bit. And then I'm going to shoot it at him. There we go. Okay. I'm pretty happy with how that transpired, to be quite honest. We did take a hit, but we also got jump scared in the process, so it's not as... It's, it's not a surprise, is it? It's not really a surprise that that happened. Okay, so we have done everything pretty much behind us. we just got to advance at this point. Okay, what are we looking at? There is a stool here. Maybe we can help out a necromorph if anyone has constipation. Oh, hello there. No! No! Damn, that is absolutely disgusting. Hey, buddy, can you let me in? No? I think we should use a big boom cannon on those bats. They are ass to deal with. Okay, so I'm going to deal with that very shortly, but I... Th oh, this is locked as well. I don't think we have the key. We do not. So we'll break this. We'll break this and... We'll get the boom cannon out. Well, that certainly did the trick. Oh, Pat! Hello! How'd you get out of here? Oh, wrong gun. Oh, that is what it is. I'm not too worried. Damn, that thing is sturdy. Okay, we'll take its legs out then, I guess. Wow, that thing face tanked a ripper blade for like seven or eight straight seconds. That is absolutely insane. Ah, small med pack. Thank you, buddy. Uh, we'll actually use that right now, I think. Because we need a little bit of health, and we've got a bunch of inventory slots that are being taken up by things that we could just straight up drink right this second. Anyone in here? 
Almost. Can we pick this up? Yeah, we can. Okay. That's funny, actually. Maybe we could slap some meat against some meat. That'd be a, that'd be a good shout as well. So what is in here? What are we doing in here? Status offline. The fuel is full. So we need... Oh, this is... This is where we opened into. So that guy right there was sitting in that chair, if I remember right, and the bat came in and just kind of resurrected him, which is a little bit of a shame. But we blew it up immediately. So we need to now engage the primary engine and the centrifuge. And then we'll actually be able to progress, I imagine. So now that we are back here, we can probably think about going into the store and buying an upgrade. Ricochet Tracer? No, thank you. We could buy one of these upgrades, right, for 11k. Actually, we're only 550 bucks away from just organically being able to um, purchase it. And we got a gold semiconductor. So that is actually fantastic. We have now just purchased our ability to upgrade one of our weapons. I think it's got to be the plasma cutter, right? It's old reliable. Or a kinetic autoloader. That just sounds like fast reload speed. I'm not interested in reload speed with the plasma rifle. In fact, I'm not even interested in shooting it. I only like its alt attack which is literally just a rocket uh, or a landmine, depending on whether or not you hit your target, I suppose. So we'll come out of here. Hopefully there's like a node bench around us as well. We'll have to check the map just to make sure. There is not. There may only be a node location at the kind of player hub with the tram station. So we'll do a spot here because we did just buy the upgrade. Good. One big fat Scott coming right up. Uh, we'll come down here because this is where the game is telling me to go. I think. No, it's actually telling me to go around the Scott station right here and into this corridor. This creepy ass abandoned corridor. Seriously? Now, what I don't know about the explosive alt attack of the plasma rifle. I don't know if it's got friendly fire because friendly fire is the most accurate form of incoming fire and I don't want to be a victim of it to be honest. So we're going to do our damnedest to not be a victim of it. This is a relaxing elevator. Actually this is nice. It's nice where we can just kind of like... Ah. Uh, mandatory decontamination. That's absolutely fine. Watch me here. Uh, I can't grab that with that telekinesis. Thank you. Uh, that bag actually scared me. I thought a necromorph was jumping out of the locker. What does this say? The gravity centrifuge is fragile equipment. All authorized personnel must undergo a thorough decontamination sequence before accessing the core. Thank you! I highly doubt that has been enforced for Yes! I knew it! There is actually like a triple bar health pack. Oh, that's gonna serve us really well in some kind of boss fight. Why have we still got the- oh, we died, that's why. Okay, uh, we got one of these little stasis bombs here that we probably could do with utilizing. I'm actually gonna do it. We'll take that plasma energy, even though it's kind of a little clearance bit bunk. Confirmed. Excellent, so we got security clearance in here, which I see a text log in. Nope, it's just an item. I probably didn't mean to open that vent. Uh, medical pack, wonderful. I'm not seeing a lot in here that is valuable. Usually in these security rooms, there's like a node at least. Okay, good. Uh, let's take this with us. It probably actually makes the most sense to take this with us into here. Because we're probably about to be attacked. Are we not? I think we are. I think we're actually about to be attacked. Oh, no we're not. This is a player hub. Oh, it's got bombs all over the place too. What's this? That is a text log. I can't wait to read that in the last episode that I do. Confirmed. Great, thanks for that one single bomb. 25 plasma rifle rounds is pretty crazy, actually, for a single bomb. But maybe we can make more efficient in the future. We just don't know. Plasma cutter upgrade graph extended. New special ability is now accessible. Excellent. And we also got a power node out of that. So we should probably think about upgrading our suit by this point. Because we haven't put any points into it. We've been kind of a little bit stupid about it. What is size? Oh, stasis zone. That's fine. And we also haven't been using stasis. We've been kind of using the pulse rifle instead. Plasma cutter, let's see what we unlocked. Wowee, we unlocked heaps. So what is this SP1? Applies damage over time to each shot. Oh, that is kind of OP. Uh, rate of fire, not really interested in. Reload, probably more interested in than rate of fire. Okay, I'm gonna go up here. Uh, we probably should have sunk one node into the damage output just down here. And maybe one here, but it doesn't make a massive difference. I think it does about 10 damage additionally. 
with each node. So basically what we are kind of gearing up to do is having the equivalent of our pistol being an absolute ass kicker of a weapon. Bit of money in here, bit of money in here. Wonderful, 500 free bucks. Now, this is a decontamination chamber. We might actually be attacked in here, which would completely invalidate the point of a decon chamber. You know what? Let's try and get one of these uh, stasis bombs in here. Uh, I'll put that there. We'll open this bad boy up. Pick this up. Come in here. Wonderful. I don't know where they might drop down from. There is a vent right there. I could probably just put it here. Use it as kind of like a mine. Yeah, I don't really see anywhere else where they mm, would obviously like come down from. Decontamination in progress. All right, I'm ready. Decontamination sequence activated. Please stand by. What else am I gonna do? Lay down? What is it even decontaminating me with? Why is it brown? Just like, uh oh, it appears as though the sewage has leaked into the decontamination fluid. I knew it! Baby! Okay, that baby is definitely down. Is there another one? I know the baby's down because the uh, a thing flew out. Of it. Baby! Baby! Baby, no! Damn, that was a good hit, actually. I'm happy with that. Okay, we'll take his bits. His little itty bitty baby bits. And we'll stop. There we go, excellent. That was a good kill. Any more? Yep. Damn, that thing is uh, a, a tanky beast. I think I killed it. Is it just me or are enemies really, really squishy in this decontamination chamber? It makes sense. Because I'm pretty sure that the Dead Space thing is a virus. Oh, we could have thrown this at something. Wasted opportunity. And we also had one of these actual necromorphs. Oh, I'm pretty sure that was distracting us from the gigantic scorpion that came in. Uh, let's take this. And we'll push on forward. Or we could just kind of like... Not take it. We, we could probably just like wait till the opportunity presents itself. No, we can't rip one from the... What's my doodle? Medium med pack schematics. That'd be nice to buy. What the hell am I hearing? That doesn't sound normal. Well, I suppose what does in this game though? Uh, let's open this up. Centrifuge, control north and south. We could go either way here. Let's see which way the game wants us to go, because I'm pretty sure it's going to be... No, we definitely have to go this way. First, which I will do. I will do exactly that. I think I've also got the hang of kind of like turning around and just gapping it out of... Oh, this is way worse than the last area we were just in. This is like a hundred times worse. Oh! 200 times worse. Something's gonna come out of there, I can guarantee it. Dex log. Great. Am I gonna be attacked while it pops up? No. Okay, let's grab this and we'll pick it up. I don't even know what that was. I think it was a valuable. Uh, we'll come down. We'll go in here. No, we can't go in there. I thought that was a, a room, but it seems not. Okay. Thanks, door. <laughs> Uh, we'll actually come through here. Good, we've got a Scott station. So if we are attacked, it's not going to be so bad. We'll Scott ourselves a nice wee slot right here. Excellent. And we'll turn around and we will now continue our adventure of being a stupid, irresponsible... Oh no. Entering <laughs> Warning. Hey, friend! Centrifuge offline. Please attach generator modules manually. Okay, I'll do that. So we're in a zero gravity area. I'm gonna open this up and take its money. There is also what looks like a stasis what's in the doodle here. Uh, hate that, big hate on that. Big hate on that front. Um, I don't really see a lot of things. We won't take that oxygen just yet. Uh, we can break these boxes, right? We can break all these boxes and we can take all of the items that pop out of them. Let's take off. So what do you want us to do there? Yeah, game. There is a thing that we can interact with. Oh no! Where is it? What is it and where is it? Whoa, okay! It's a school thing. Man, this plasma cut actually does quite a bit of damage. It's stunning the scorpions now. Nice! I'm taking his bits. 
or not. I wanted to, I wanted to take its, I probably literally took its bits and that's exactly what I said I would do, but uh, that's not necessarily what I wanted to do. Okay, we'll move this gigantic Watson the Doodle. Oh no, that sounds like a, a holdout fight to me. Sounds like a holdout fight's coming. What about this one? Do we have to like do them in an order, maybe? Potentially. Who? No. Right, I don't see anything beneath the centrifuge. I think everything's got to be in here. Oh, what the hell is this? Oh. Oh. His intestines all over the centrifuge. Yuck. Okay, well that's just gross. I've actually just figured it out by my lonesome. Oh, I'm just watch, watch out for that necromorph's head right there. We've got to stasis it. We've got to get it like um, close enough. And then we got to use stasis. I wonder if we can do this while we're TKing it. No, we cannot. Uh, do you want to maybe use your stasis there? Okay, good. Now we use stasis and we jam it in. Excellent. That actually did the trick. Did it attract Necromorph? Yes, it most certainly did. Hello there, friendo. Where'd he go? There he is. Damn it, he is quick. He's really quick, actually. Okay, good. We've toasted him. Uh, we'll take his pulse rounds, because that's a free grenade. And now we have to do, what, like one, two more? Probably just the one more, actually, honestly. Uh, let's get this bad boy in place. About there should be good. And then we will use our stasis. And then we'll get this jammed in there. Oh, excellent. It was just too fast. It was way too fast earlier. Generator module attached. Clutch engaged. Really? All personnel clear for centrifuge restart. Where are the necromorphs though? I know there's another one in here. I can almost guarantee another one spawn. Oh well. Alright, that's where we came through and apparently we can't go back through there, which is a little bit of a shame. Uh, we could probably just check our map. What are we looking at? That is our inventory. Not helpful. There actually is no indicator, except for a little green dot right here. What is this? Okay, if only there was a way of literally just strafing upwards or downwards. It doesn't really look like there's anything around here, is there, that we can kind of interact with, which is a shame. There is a door leading over here. Oh, money. Yes, please. Take that, and we'll come over here, we'll land, and we'll see if this isn't... Ah, that's exactly what we need. Okay, let's restart this bad boy. Boom! I love how this is a fragile piece of equipment, and we're still just like... It, we're just blowing it open with all of this flotsam all over the place. It doesn't make any sense. Huge activated. Re-establishing balance with tectonic load. Wonderful. Okay, so can we take off? No, we cannot. Which way are we supposed to be going? Manually ignite the engines. Piss. That's not what we want. Uh, O2 right here. Excellent. No, that's not what we want to use. We want to use that. I don't see anything out here that could constitute as a threat. But we are in a dead area of space. That's not good. Uh, let's break that. We'll take whatever was in it. Yes, please. Another free grenade for the pulse rifle is fantastic. Uh, let's go and use this oxygen resupply, and we will come through here and use this here elevator. Because I think this is the way. I don't think we can take off, because I'm pretty sure that the... This gigantic like moving thing... Oh, back yes. Online. All that's left is restarting the engines, right? Okay, we probably have to Bring go this way, right? Oh uh, yeah, there's definitely enough room for us to go. And we'll wait for it to pass. Excellent. And we'll come all the way through here. Piss on that guy! Uh, oh no! Okay, I have to kill him. I have to kill him right here. Good. And we will stomp on him. We have a, an oxygen recharge station right here. Did that centrifuge actually kill that guy? Oh, yes it did actually. He crapped out a hundred bucks. That's nice. Uh, we'll come all the way around here. I think I may have left it just slightly too late. Damn, that was close. Uh, I'm going to push my luck as well and go all the way around again. So what are we looking for? Actually, we may have had to go this way. 
Because this seems unusually close. Ah, yeah, I think we do actually. This might be the other lift upwards. Okay, good. And what are we looking at? No threats. I see no threats. I see no threats. Except for this bat, which I'm gonna blow up. I'm not taking any chances. Oh, piss! Oh no, it's a scorpion! Damn! These things suck, actually. These things are the pits. Uh, blow that up. Uh, we are currently suffocating, which is not amazing. Maybe we should have actually kept the item. No, we're good, actually. I think we've just left the bat. Yeah, okay, we have. I'm actually going to go back and I am going to go and grab the item that that scorpion has. I also don't know if it's called a scorpion. I just assume that that's its name because it's got a giant barbed tail. Good. Uh, all right, we'll come back through. We'll do a Scott. I'm pretty confident about this, honestly. We've restarted the centrifuge, which is very cash money. And we're in a pretty good place. We haven't lost much health. We've got a lot of ammo that we did not have when we started this episode. So... I am going to count my chickens right now, and I'm going to thank you so much for watching. Right up here, you're going to find the playlist for Dead Space 2024. And right up here, you're going to find another playlist that I think you'd really enjoy. And of course, just over there is my subscribe button. Why don't you click it on the way down to the description of this video, where you'll find a link to my Discord, where you can chat with me and my community personally. And of course, until I make the next episode, thank you so much for watching. I will see you later. Goodbye!